Hey you all, welcome back. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we'll be visiting Target in Union, New Jersey. Well, technically Vauxhall, New Jersey. Um, Yeah, and it's looking pretty crappy in here. That's one thing that I can say. A bit unorganized in some aisles, but they do have some items available. Like these gallons of water, for instance. They had the distilled water coming in at only 89 cents. Um, but that is for the Good and Gather brand. They had a few cases available as well. Um, when it came down to their snacks, I've been saying this in multiple stores, the snacks have been low. Also here, as you guys can see, plenty of boxes. Seems like they probably just don't have enough workers. Though I did see, like it was a lot of workers walking around the store chips here two for eight dollars i saw some two for six dollars two for ten dollars chips are not worth buying anymore at this point the dry cat food had plenty of gaps as well if you're not stocked up for your animals during the winter time definitely get that as well 629 for a 32 pack of polling spring water you guys water is getting expensive the price of water is definitely going up from the gallons to the liters to the single ounce bottles water is becoming so expensive let me know if you guys are more so stocked up on water or a way to have your water filtered um when it comes down to the price of this 30 pack well variety pack of the cookies and crackers Oh my gosh, they wanted eleven dollars and fifty nine cents. That's expensive. They did have a so called sale on some of the K pots and things here, um, but it really wasn't a sale sale. If you know what I mean, mm -hmm. I mean it caught up to me already that the old price, well, the sale price is really nothing but the original old price on a lot of these items. So technically, are we really getting a sale? Um. This hot chocolate here and this little glass jar look very interesting. I just wanted to show you guys as well. Yes, they were very cute. And when you in the store, little cute things put together like this would just make you just buy, buy, buy. Um, they also had the taste of choice. Same price as Walmart, $10.79, guys. Um, the Cafe Bustello, that was coming in at $15.69. Those Folgers, $14.49. So the price of coffee is definitely going up. Um, What was I saying? Oh, I was saying about the sale price. So the sale price is nothing but the old original price. Um, And people keep asking, well, I hear people keep saying when the prices go back down. Do we know for sure if the prices will go back down? Because nine times out of 10, once something come up, it's not going back down. You know, you might see a dip in the price here and there. Like, for instance, the eggs, the price of the eggs did go down a bit. Um, but then, you know, the price of oil you did go up. So, you know, it's, it's give and take, give and take. They also have vegetables here in Target today. But a Del Monte is coming in at $1.49 a a can best buy year is 2024 as you guys can see the condition of the cans is not probably the best but like i said <clears throat> you guys giving and taking the good and gather is only 65 cents here it's still much cheaper at walmart but depending on you know your mobility and where you can get maybe a target is closer to you rather than a walmart um, that's what some people have to understand. Some people say, I don't know why this person shop at Target. I don't know why this person shop at Walmart. Well, it depends on what's close to that person and what works for them at the same time. If they have to go to Target to get their preps and get items, <clears throat> then that's what they have to do. You know, don't knock the next person because you do not know what the next person is going through. Their seasoning is a bit low. They actually have brown sugar. I've seen brown sugar going low as well and plenty of stores domino coming in at 2.99 versus the good and gather for 179 their four pound bags of sugar is two dollars and 99 cents y'all two dollars and 99 cent they have the gallon of peanut oil you here for 13.99 y'all i've seen it for ten dollars before 
Um, $9.79 for the regular gallon of vegetable oil. And of course, still, they are more expensive than Target. Um, their dairy section is low. Let me know in your, in any of you area areas, are your dairy sections low? Because over here in New Jersey, yes, the dairy section have been very low. I did notice that they had the mambo sauce, but they still, like I said, a bit more expensive, um, in Target. So I did not get any, their ketchup is low. So if you guys know that y'all need, need a little dipping dipping sauce or that ketchup make sure y'all stock up on y'all ketchup now because not only is it going to be disappearing off these shelves but the price will be going up peanut butter and jelly not really it wasn't much here to really show um very low but they did have more peanut butter than they had jelly so that was interesting to see as well their macaroni section was very low as well. Um, I've seen people in Target with a cart full of food. So some people definitely come grocery shopping in Target. And I know when they walk into to Target and they don't see like their items and maybe this is the closest store to them. I can imagine how it would definitely upset them. But please don't forget, there are services offered nowadays, like delivery services, but it's not offered in every single area. It does depend on where you live. So check out Instacart, Amazon Fresh, check out um, Walmart Plus and all of that good stuff. Not everywhere have delivery services though. But if you do have it, definitely utilize it. This will save you time from going from store to store to store looking for things. Unless it's like meat and, um, you know, your vegetables and stuff like that. I would definitely say get that yourself. They had little eggs available. Not too much. Um, Like I said, anything to do with the dairy and all of that stuff. Very limited. Not a lot. Like I said, I'm located in New Jersey, guys. So I'm reporting out of North New Jersey most of the time, Excess County. Um, so yes, they had chicken available. A six pack of Purdue chicken wings coming in at seven dollars and forty-two cents. The chicken don't look all that good, but they did have it available for the most part. Um, that's all that really matter. And then they had chicken breast coming in at eleven eighty-seven. For $2.99 a pound, they did have some produce available. The red meat section was very thin. Not a lot of options. The cooked pasta, same thing as well. Not a lot of options. Um, I'm definitely feeling like some, some owls would be removed because it's like they're putting a lot of different stuff in an owl, you know, just to make it look like it's something there. The medication, guys, I'm seeing this in more and more stores as well medications is running very low as the season has changed definitely guys stock up on your medication and your vitamins um i feel like i'm saying this every single video it's always someone new watching and if you have not stocked up on your medications and your vitamins um things that you know you typically need during the winter time especially um yeah, get it now. This way you're not rushing to the store and say, hey, I don't have this. But you know that you usually use it every single winter or so. Get it now. Um, It's, it's not bad to just have it on hand. So this is our end of our Walmart walkthrough. I'm about finished with this store, y'all. Finished with it. Yes, I'm done. So we're going to leave this right here. And I was glad to take all of you along with me to Target located in Vauxhall, New Jersey. You guys, this is Shauna from Moments With Us. And I want to make sure that you guys are staying prepped, staying blessed, and staying safe. Hopefully you guys said it along with me. I hope so. Most of all, remain beautiful queens and kings. I am out of here.